Hi, Laura Conrad here with All About Wearing Hair. I'm doing an updated review on my Penelope wig. I did an unboxing of her about a month ago. So I have worn her, I have sized her, and I just cannot explain how madly in love I am with this wig. It is my favorite wig that I have ever had, and I have had a lot of them. I even say that over an eye wig. Now, is the cap as comfortable as an eye wig? Well, nothing is as comfortable on my head as an eye wig, but the color, the hair quality, the hair texture, the density, everything is, is my favorite wig. And I've had so many wigs. Here she is. And the pictures online, of course, don't do it justice. Her color is, I would say, I mean, she's bronze, but neutral. She's got a little bit of neutral, Maybe a little bit of cool tone. Anyway, this is a color that Penelope Wigs will be making more of, and she's going to be making caps that are custom to your head. So who doesn't want that? But especially for, well, there's so many of us where you're shorter front to nape or longer or shorter ear to ear or your circumference, you have a flat head like me. So she can, she can teach you how to make a mold and then She'll make your cap to that construction. She's incredible. I love the woman and I love her wigs. Oh my goodness. So this was a small medium. I knew she was gonna be too big for me and she was. It's fine because you can sew them. You can stitch it very easily. Now I'm gonna restitch this one, but I wanna show you what I did. So I love this kind of a cap, first of all, because you don't need scar tape with it. It's kind of like a silk liner. It, uh, I mean, I, they might even call this a silk liner. I would call this kind of a meshy piece of lace, like mesh lace. It's very comfortable. I took out the clips. I'm sure it had clips, but I took them out because I always take the clips out. It does have the bendable ear tabs, so it can mold to your head. At least it feels like it. Maybe it doesn't, and it stays down anyway. Oh my goodness, I thought I had them, and it doesn't. But it doesn't lift. Oh no, it does have it. There it is, found it. It's a little smaller. It's back here. Okay, I was gonna say I knew I had them. There we go. So it does have them right here. So even if you take the clips out, you can um, still fit it to your head. It does come with a comb at the bottom. I haven't removed that yet. I don't know, I don't feel it. Probably will eventually, because I will never sell this wig. I have sewn her. So the first place that I sewed her was right here. And typically I start at the top part of the ear tab here, and I piece, I pinch together, like however much, if you feel it in the back of your head, and you wanna try and do the same on each side. So I pinched it together, and I sewed it here all the way down to here. Sometimes if they're really big back here, I'll take the comb out and I'll stitch it there. And then on this side, I wasn't sure how I wanted to size it, so, I size this one here. Sometimes that works as well. The way I did this, and because it's so low density, I can feel this. You can't see it, but if I do that with my hand, I can feel this on the back of my head. So I will remove this and I will redo it over on the side, on this side. Again, you can start on either end of it and you just pinch some of the fabric and you just sew it and sew it and there's lots of YouTube videos, and you take it out, if you're careful, especially, this is a little different fabric here, so it's more like a lace there. So you would wanna be you know, careful with that material. It's maybe not quite as durable as this material, but you can to totally still size it. You just be careful with it. Uh, and when you take it out, you can't even tell it's been sewed. You know? So if you are thinking about resell. You know, when I size a wig, I pretty much know I'm not gonna resell it, but Here's how she looks with that mesh. So when you have her on, and see how it's like this? When you have her on, you can't. You just can't detect it. It's awesome. It's very close to a boju or a sai. Boju hair quality and how the sai caps, the transition is just like impeccable. So this is my Penelope wig. If you have never had one from her, you need to stock her site and get one. That's all I have to say.
stock one, stock her site, get one. You will not regret it. She, they're incredible. So that's all I have to say. I'm going to keep tooting her horn because she's absolutely amazing. I'm going to stop this video and do another one on a K&S wig, the K&S custom wigs from Kendra's Wigs. I'm going to do a quick review on that. So stay tuned.